the point. My best, yeah. indeed, uh, let's, call, let's call it a uh, look. What is the fact that I'm from Tipperary, where the, where the first shots in the war of independence were fired? For, where is the fact that I listen to rebel hats, or indeed uh, the rattle the boards, and Des Dillon, and Dom O'Driscoll, and wonderful ballads and songs? No. Yes, section one. And I'm replying yeah. to the minister. Yeah. How dare he say that I'm mean and I'm nasty? How dare he? I'm representing the people that I read out here that a survey of the 4,100 members, and they, they discovered that 11.6% couldn't pay their uh, utility bills, 9.7% had to sell essential equipment. Uh, Seven percent have lost over, uh, have lost or in danger of losing their vehicle, which they have to manage. The same vehicle might be for the family, for going to the beach or going to school, picking up the kids. Thirty-four percent, uh, three point four percent, in danger of losing their home. Is that mean and nasty? Because she doesn't sit well with yourself, Minister. Seventeen point four percent are dealing with mental health worries as a result of, of financial stress. Is that mean and nasty? 2.4% have considered attempting self-harm. It's shocking. And because, the Minister, I'm not being personal to you, but I'm being personal, I'm being uh, direct to the government. As I said, there's lots of things about this whole situation that I don't like. We also have the taxis that Deputy uh, Barrett mentioned, uh, and we also have the man in the van. All the different vans, whether they be vans or lorries or trucks, self-employed people out there who can't get a penny. And of course we have the over 66ers. And to represent them up here, and keep representing them, who have got nothing after all they've done for this country, and they're still doing away in their families and their grandchildren, and many more working in the pubs, the pubs that have been misled and blackguarded and denied, and in the over 66, a penny, a shilling. They were put out of business by the government, and I'm being mean and nasty because I have the audacity to represent them. And the teacher asked me last week what planet I was on. I'm on planet Tipperary and planet Earth, thank God, and I'm trying to look after these people. And that's all I'm doing. And I, and I second what Deputy Doherty said, I'm not going to do any longer, that we should have some kind of a forum tomorrow uh, or the next day. I know the dollar won't be here the next day. And if we had to sit Friday and we had to sit Monday, we can't go off for six weeks' break, let these people. Look at the figures 2.4% of attempted self harm. Are we going to let them be crushed? They have families, they have wives and families and children, and they have trying to cling on to what. They do best, and that is always give solace to us from what they do. They're just givers, and they, 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 they naturally give enjoyment and, and solace and support to us in difficult times, as, as other Blippies have said. So I'm not being nasty, I'm not being mean, mean and I don't accept that at all from, from Minister O'Donoghue.